Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to fix keyboard not working error in Windows 10 PC or laptop. It is a very simple error and I give the multiple solution to fix this error. So let's go. Our first method is just to start, right click on the start. Here we find device manager, just click on the device manager. In device manager, just expand keyboard, just find keyboards and expand keyboards. Here we find our keyboard, just click on the your keyboard, right click on your keyboard and just go to the update drivers. Okay, search automatically for drivers. It is search your drivers on internet. Just click at here, okay. If drivers, updated drivers or latest drivers is available for you, then it shows drivers, then install their drivers. If not, then it is show the base drivers for your device are already installed. So we just go to the back, our drivers is updated or the till the date, okay. Now just go to the back and here just click on the Browse my computer for driver. Just click at here. It search your drivers on your local machine. If local machine drivers are available, then just go to the browse and just install it. If not, then just go to the let me pick up latest available drivers on my computer. Just click at here. Just select your latest drivers and just click on the next. Now it's install your drivers, then close it. Now it's asked for restart. Just click on the yes and restart your machine. Okay. And if this method is not work for you, then another method is just go to the here close. Now just go to the right click on the start and just go to the device manager once again. Okay. Expand keyboards, expand keyboards, right click on your keyboard and just uninstall device, just uninstall device and just click on uninstall and just click on the yes and just restart your machine, just restart your machine. Now my machine is restart. If these two methods are not work for you, then I give the third method. Third method is also very simple. Just go to the start. Just click on the start button. Here we find settings. Just click on the settings icon at here. Okay. Now setting is open. Okay. Now here we find easy of access. Just click on the easy of access. In easy of access, just scroll down and just find keyboard. Just click on the keyboards. Here we find use on screen keyboard. It is on off then on it. Now it show a virtual keyboard on your PC. Now just go to the start and just go to the here and just type run R U N run and just click on this run. Okay. Run. Here is the run. Just click on this run. Okay. And here just type R E G E D I T R E G Reggie edit. Okay. Just type by this keyboard. R E G E D I T. Just type this and just click on the OK. I just minimize it and just click on the yes. Now registered editor is open like this. Just go to the computer first and here just go to the H key local machine. Just go to the H key local machine first. In H key local machine, just go to the system, expand system, and after that current control set just expand current control set here just go to the services just go to the services at this point expand services in services just find i80 just find i80 42 prt just find this for port uh, folder i80 42 prt just find this just click at here at here we find start right click on the start and just do the modify just modify it and change it value data from the three to one just change it now just close it or click on the okay sorry not a close just click on the okay at this point change the value data to one and just click on the one at the start and then just click close this box now just restart your machine just right click on it or just go to the here power button and restart your machine after machine is restart, I just will start and just go to notepad. I just type notepad and my keyboard is now working. Okay. I type anything on my keyboard. So guys, this is the simplest way to fix this simplest problem. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.